to celebrate the cow hug day on February 14th instead of Valentine's Day. I am sure thousands of RSS volunteers and BJP workers would follow with the diktat to hug the Gomadas without thinking about its consequences. Sir, I request the minister to allocate at least, at least another 500 crores to department in the supplementary demands to give compensation and meet the treatment expenses. Here a cola halankum, Vivadan Seshamana, Kendra Ausanam, A Uttera Pin Velichad, Kendra Briga Sambrashana open day, Kau Hagade Utteravan, Kari Dosam, Kendra than a Pin Velichad. In an E Uttera Pin Velikanaman, Sabel than a Parna or Impiund, IMP, Kerlathan Olympian. Alapin Lambi A Marifan, E. Karim, Kirti Madden, the Sabah person of the Panga, Matramella, Adem, Rasagara Madden, BJP Karim, Ars there and Tolagan Jedu, Adem Parga the Ganyana. Kauka Kate would come on the animal welfare board of Parentund, Adagarna in the Ars in the Sanga Portan Mar, Pasu in a Ponaram and Pogan Jeep, Angana Poe Kenyan, Pasu in the Gain, our Chow to get to Jeep, Chow to get to Kola, Arugatum, Chow to their old chicken sick Mendi, where Anur voted an extra animal welfare board of Kodakam on the Varna, the Rumala Sidaramani, BJP Karim, Avaram Munil Vachan and Tolikan. Alapremi, A. Marif, Adam Matramella, Samsana Sarkarni, Ken Sarkarni, Compare, Uribadi Karin, or the Barnato, Valer Prasakta, my Prasangamana, Bajane Kursi, Kendra Bajane Kursi, Umarsanatama, Prasangamana, A. Marif, in the Lok Sabinata, other than a Prasangam, Namkon the Galka. Sir, all through these years in power, this government has succeeded in nothing but coining catchy words for deceiving the ordinary people of the country. So this government came to power promising the people that Acha Din Ane Wale. And now they realize that what the government mean was Acha Ache Din, not for them but for crony capitalists. So then ne came Sabka Sad Sabka Vigas, which was later modified incorporating Sabka Vishwas and Sabka Prayas. But common people were not knowing that for the Modi government, Sabka mean for not all just for Adani and Ambani, etc. And now it's just time for Amrudagal. Sir, precisely speaking, an extended Amrudagal till 2047. By this extension, the government is again deceiving the ordinary people and simply asking them to wait till, to, till 2047 to see the fall promises broken away. Sir, coming to the budgetary provision made in this budget, the government is again and again proclaiming its anti-people policies and showing its insensitives to the ordinary people, including farmers and laborers. Sir, let come to the MGNREG. All the former speakers have spoken about it. I'm not going along it. So the program is still remains a game changer in rural India, but is subject to mercy killing. Sir, MGNREG is subject to mercy killing by this government. Sir, for this first time since its induction, the allocation is rupees 60,000 made in the budget has gone down to less than 0.2 percentage of the GDP. Sir, well, as it has been estimated by the economists that it should be at least 1.6 percentage of the GDP. Sir, MGNREG is a demanded driver law and we have seen that especially after the COVID-19, which has affected the life and livelihood of the common people, there has been huge increase in the demand for work in rural areas. Sir, if all the households who have demanded jobs are to be provided 100 days of work as stipulated by the law, how much should be the actual allocation? <laughs> Sir, similar in the case of umbrella programs for the minorities, the allocation for which was drastically reduced to just 530 crores from 1810 crores last year. Sir, and what about Rashtri Krishi Vigas Yojana? Allocation reduced from last year's 10,433 crores to 7,150 crores. Sir, hence it is crystal clear that this budget is against the interest of the farmers, against the minorities, against the common people and above all against the interest of our country. Sir, the Honorable Minister has earmarked 4,327.85 crores for the Department of the Animal Husbandry 
and dairy. So far, so good, sir. But in view of the appeal of the Animal Welfare Board to celebrate the Cow Hug Day on February 14th instead of Valentine's Day, I am sure thousands of RSS volunteers and BJP workers would follow with the dicta to hug the Gomadas without thinking about its consequences. Sir, I request the minister to allocate at least another 500 crores to department in the supplementary demands to give compensation and meet the treatment expenses. Those who hurt by the attack of the Gomadas on trying to hug them. Sir, I am scary. There is another plot hidden behind this love for Gomada, which is nothing but to give opportunity to, to attack Muslims and Christians alleging their hug to Gomadas as unholy. Sir, I request to Honorable Prime Minister Nirbila Sidharamji, either allocate more funds or least to put pressure on Purushottam Nirubala ji to advise the Animal Welfare Board to withdraw the, its advisory. Sir, all the centrally sponsored programs implemented by the government, starting with the name Pradhan Mandri Yojana, PMGSY, PMAY, Jal Jeevan Mission, all are portrayed by the exclusive scheme of the union government. Through the state bear, 50% of the expenses or more in most cases. In the case of PMA wise, for, sir, for example, in Kerala, the state government is providing a total of 4 lakhs rupees for each unit out of its central share is just 1.5 lakhs in urban areas and just 72,000 in rural areas. Sir, the states spend more than 60 to 70% of the total outlay and the credit for providing Housing for all is claimed by the government without any shame. Kerala government already constructed 3.25 lakhs houses and delivered the key to the beneficiaries. Sir, I wonder whether Honorable Finance Minister acknowledges that Kerala is one among the state of the country. None of the demands made by the Kerala is considered. Sir, I wish to draw the attention of the Honorable Finance Minister of Kerala demands GST revenue share may be changed to 60 40 in the ratio GST compensation to be extended for another five years treat guarantees given by KIFB and the KSSPL as contingent liabilities and not as equal to open market borrowing aims in Kerala Ayurveda research in Kerala Kerala Malabar Cancer Center in Thalesheri, special package to return migrants, special assistance to universal MG and NREG, special scheme for cashew, care and handloom agriculture and traditional sectors, doubling of Ernagulam, Kayangulam railway line, approval of semi-high speed railway line, point of call recognition of Kannur International Airport. All demands were rejected in the budget only because you have no hope a single seat from Kerala in the, for the coming, ele for the coming election. Sir, by using Kerala government fund, welfare pension comparison, you may please note it. Farmers, 6,000 rupees in three installments in Kisan Samad in Kerala, 100 and 600 every month. That is 19,200. We are working with a single engine, not a double engine. Only with a single engine. Old age pension, up to 80 years, 80 years, 200. And uh, up to uh, above 80 years, 500, but Kerala giving above 60, 60 years, 1,600 per month. Sir, widow pension, central giving 200, Kerala giving 1,600 per month. Disability person, central giving 200, Kerala giving 106 per month. Sir, this is the situation. Sir, after the BJP government has come to power in 2014, about 10 lakhs and 5 lakh crore worth bad loads of the corporate were written off. Whereas I even amidst the hardship of COVID-19, not a single paisa of loan taken by the common people was written off. Sir, one minute. Sir. Instead, this government has penalized by announcing the moratorium on loans because of which they were actually charged penal interest for loan amount during the moratorium period. Sir, when the poor people of the country are become the more poorer, business empires built by corporate like Adani and Ambani is looting the public money. Sir, and this government has no courage to send ED, CBI or SEBI to their doorsteps even when they are trying to destabilize or 
our economy by creating shell companies and manipulation of stocks. Honorable Prime Minister spoke yesterday that ED is joining all opposition parties. At the same time, what is ED doing? ED is doing election duty for the ruling party. Sir, sir, again and again, the, this government is showing that they are anti-people and anti-development anti of the countries. Only for the Adanis and Abins. So, I, again, I request to Honorable Minister, Finance Minister, and always I am, I am demanding that please allocate sufficient please funds to the now. convert, convert project sector KV, Kendriya Vidyalaya, into civil sector, including Kendriya Vidyalaya Kayangulam. You can save hundreds of crores of rupees allocated for the new KV. And by these words, I conclude my speech. Thank you. Thank you.